Thanks for checking out Hyperfish Lite. There are three easy steps to get started. First, you will need to sign in with your Office 365 account. This can be a standard Office 365 user because we only require read your profile information and signing in for the first part of the onboarding process. Once you've signed in, Hyperfish will get you to add pilot users that you want to be involved in the pilot of Hyperfish. If these pilot users don't have photos, Hyperfish will contact them via email or Skype for Business, notifying them that their photo is missing. And with our dashboard, you can see exactly how many users are missing their photos. When the user receives the email, they can click on the link, which will automatically open up the Hyperfish profile page updater. They can drag and drop their photo image into the page, or they can pick it from a file picker. They can then crop the photo to make sure just their face is in the photo. When they click save, you'll notice that that photo says pending because by default we have approval on. We can't do the approval and actually write back to Office 365 until you go in as the administrator for your tenant. Any Office 365 global administrator can consent the read and write all user profiles. So if you're a business user that isn't a global administrator, you will need to get them to log in and go through this step. Once you've done the administrative consent, you can click on the approval section on the left hand side and start to approve the photos and then Hyperfish will start to write those back into Office 365. The user can then see that his profile has been approved and the pending sign will no longer be there. And then if he checks in his My Account information or in Microsoft Teams or in Contact Cards and Outlook, he'll see the profile photo is there and present. So what are you waiting for? It takes two minutes to get going and you'll have complete photos across your entire organization in no time.